So I tell them that uh, when I have to sell something to them as a nightmare, that have you ever gone to Ladakh or not? And if they say no, I said when you go up to the heaven, the Almighty will not open the door for you. He will say first go, go back to down again, down, and go to go to Ladakh. Ladakh then come back here. Then first visit it for one week minimum. See the real raw beauty. Whether you go to Kargil site, yes. Kardumla. Kardumla. The roads were not there actually. Now it is still becoming much clearer. Now it is good. But, but at that time it was real raw way. Uh, no roads at all. And you are passing one bus, uh, one uh, car along with the other one. And if you see downside, you only see deep gorges. I remember once I got a bit scared. And in life anybody can get scared. So I was on the front seat. The Scorpio is actually over there. Much more good to travel than the other one. So I put on the handle like this. So that when I'm, I when I start watching this side, I don't see the deep gorges. Because I was scared mentally. But that is the real beauty. If you have not seen that place, then something you have missed out in life. This is my personal belief yeah. about Ladakh in particular. Good evening everybody. My name is Mukesh Jagga and I am from the channel Venue.Events. It's a travel based channel and we take the thoughts of people who have traveled around the world in our own country, India or abroad. And also we discuss about the venues where a good event of whether meetings etc. can be held or any social function can be held. Uh, since my childhood, uh, I had a dream that if Almighty can make me allow to travel only once in my lifetime on a flight or a meal in a hotel or a good restaurant, I would be very satisfied in my life because life was that way. However, India changed and now travel is was which was only a luxury. Now definitely still is a luxury, but a lot of people more because of affordable fares and destinations which are possible. People have been traveling around and will keep on traveling around. Uh, today, my guest is Madam Sheila Jha and Mr. Nikhil Jha. Uh, Mr. Nikhil Jha runs a pharma company and he has been traveling since when he was working with another company. Uh, and he has traveled on the roadways in the night and taken all kind of experiences along. And today, because he runs his own company, he has to travel for his business reasons and other reasons. So I would like to today take their viewpoint that how the travel has helped them uh, in their business and also which all places they would have traveled to a lot of places and one of the places which they would like to talk about which they have liked. Mr. Nikhil, over to you first of all. Hi, good evening. So, as Mukesh sir said that uh, since childhood, it's the same dream, you know, but I love travel since uh, on a roadways buses and uh, private buses, then overnight buses, then trains, then uh, dream of traveling all the world. That was, I'm sure everybody have that kind of dream to go anywhere, I mean, everywhere in the world. I am fortunate in that way that I got kind of company where I worked and I also traveled there many places. Uh, now I'm having my own company since last 10 years. So here I'm getting more opportunity to travel along with my guest and most of the time alone for the business point of view also. And there are many other reasons for travelings. I've traveled more than 37 countries so far and uh, many countries many times repeats especially switzerland i've traveled five, five times but uh, unfortunately last four time i travel only for two days one day or from there i have to move to some other part of the world so last time i traveled uh, actually explored i'm um, in switzerland for six seven days exclusively and uh, on that trip i understand actually 
uh, how Switzerland to be moved. That's a that's a that's a subject actually we'll talk. So this is things over to you now. Okay, uh, madam, हम सबने travel देखा है. Again, जो हम बात कर रहे थे buses के अंदर में overnight buses. एयर एयर कंडीशन नहीं होता था लेकिन उसका एक अलग चाम था ट्रेन में भी इसी तरह से एसी की एक या दो कोचेस ही केवल होती थी एंड वी हैड मोर ऑफ सेकंड क्लास स्लीपर ट्रेन्स व्हाट हैव यू एंजॉयड मोर वेदर इट इज दी बसेस ट्रेवल विच यू लाइक एज एन इंडिविजुअल ट्रेन और एयर एज एन इंडिविजुअल चॉइस एज एन इंडिविजुअल I would like to buy, go by train because I don't like uh, bus. I have a motion sickness, mm-hmm. and uh, um, by flight also I don't feel comfortable. If you find comfortable, we should go by train only. And I feel I enjoy the train a lot. Yeah, I agree with you. I think so. हम सब का passion ही train है. दिल के अंदर कहीं वो बचपने के अंदर में या आज भी सब के अंदर में वो बसा हुआ है. कि ट्रेन का जो ट्रेवल है और वो स्टीम इंजन में जो ट्रेवलिंग ट्रेवलिंग के दौरान जो वो नजारे दिखते रहते हैं उस चीज का वर्णन कहीं कहीं नहीं मतलब कहीं नहीं हो सकता सकते मुझे याद है बिकॉज मैं फादर वॉज इन द रेलवे तो मुझे सैलून में भी ट्रेवल करने का मौका मिला एंड देन ऑल्सो आई रिमेम्बर दी ओल्ड डेज की जहाँ पर ताज एक्सप्रेस जो कि नई दिल्ली से सिर्फ आगरा तक जाती थी एंड देन आपके साथ में एक चैंट्री कार भी होती थी कि जहाँ पर इन द ट्रेन यू वुड ईट अ मील और उसका वहाँ पर बैठकर चाय पीने का या कुछ खाने का जो कि आज यूरोप में भी हम लोग जब ट्रेवल करते हैं तो वी कैन हैव अ गुड सैंडविच और बियर और कॉफी और वट एवर वन लाइक टू है Uh, these things also existed, but not in too many trains. But that was the real charm of real good old India. Uh, I totally agree with you on that part. Nikhilji, since you talked about Switzerland, and you said that you have already be visited over there five times, and now you have a good backhand experience of Switzerland. Uh, what are the different places that you have visited over there? See, uh, for Switzerland. If I go by somebody who by my choice, then you should have six, seven days itinerary for a minimum itinerary for Switzerland. Not for like usually I find out we Indian travel three nights, four nights, and then trying to add some more country, and then just itinerary to complete it. But actually, if you really want to explore any country in Europe also, you need to spend six, seven nights a minimum to understand. and the various aspect of the countries like what are their transportation mode what are their foods what are their streets uh, how their night life is there and how their uh, day to day activities and other works so i especially suggest six seven nights we don't do travel and the spots uh, the very famous spots you all know that tetlis and the jungfrau is a two common uh jungle whenever people think of switzerland they think of two places or maybe our region no, for the first time for the first time what's yeah, it is in the I destination mean, our agents also suggesting the like ways that you can go to jungfrau then you can go to tetlis yes obviously they no doubt about that these two places are very good it should be in the itinerary uh there you can uh, enjoy ice flyer in the tetlis and then you can go for a skiing also If you really interested for that, and uh, you can also track. I mean, you can go on ice, and then uh, Jungfrau is no doubt it's a Europe top, so you must visit the place. In 2017, the Switzerland started Glacier 3000, mm-hmm. which is really uh, should be now one of the important in your itinerary, especially because uh, that is a place which give you real pleasure of ice if you really love. Ice, and if you're going for Switzerland to have a cold experience, then you must visit that one. Uh, it's a beautiful. It's a three thousand glaciers. Uh, one can travel through Montreux to Gestard. Gestard is a expensive place of uh, Switzerland. Actually, it is a 
mostly in wide expensive places. And there's a hotel called Palace Hotel. You have to pay around 2 lakh rupees per night to stay there. Mm-hmm. And there are many schools where a billion hour child study there. And there's a street only about 1 kilometer hardly. You can solve the entire world there. Whether it's a Pathé, whether it's a Prada or Louis Vuitton or whatever you want to buy. Then that's the shopping place also. And then uh, you can travel to Glacier, from 20 minutes from there. And uh, when you come down, there is a good restaurant. It's a Swiss restaurant. You have a Swiss lunch. It's a very nice lunch that they offered you. So it's a fantastic place to go. And after that, you can add one more itinerary nowadays, Jermatt. It is a quite good experience, two hours journey from Montrex. Mm-hmm. And then you can go to uh, that German place and you can also enjoy the ice. It's an open ice place actually. Right. Like that place and this place also has a good one. As well as these two at least should be at it. Along with that, if really one can start, you have to go to Geneva to see the lake view, have yep. a coffee there. And then you can watch some official places like mm-hmm. Red Cross, WHO. You know, everything to be there. So you can enjoy that places for half day only. And uh, then you can move out for one day in Montrex, from where you can um, go to Sailor's Chocolate Factory. And then you can travel to Charlie Chaplin Show, much visited place. Along with that, you can do Olympic Museums. Apart from that, you can put one more day for Luzon, where you can do the, the best brand watches shopping. Any amount you can expect, the watch is available. Right. So apart from that, you can go to travel with the, you know, one cruise. It's a good time pass cruise, one hour, two hours, you can spend there with the cruise. Then you can stay, that city is beautiful. And then transport museum, you must visit. Because if you are going to children, that is a must visit place to be there. Because the children can enjoy for a whole day. Right. Because you got all kind of modern transportation system there. And how... Switzerland getting help from the other country to developing the space center actually. They don't have actually a space center. They are getting help from the China and uh, some Dubai, Arab and some many places they're getting the help to managing their transport system. And then if you start traveling, you have to think on the traveling part, uh, which airlines you like to go. There is a Swiss Airways, that is a direct flight which is good, but to old airlines, you can say. So, it is good to travel if you want to really go to direct to Delhi to Zurich. If you are really want to enjoy the flight, then you must travel with only one airline, that is Emirates. Right. Which is the excellent airlines, I um, mean, in, in terms of in-flight entertainment, in terms of their experience to traveling. Uh, they are trying to be on time, and they are maintaining that. That is the one thing. If you travel in the business class, uh, ultimate business class, you have just all launch facilities there, along with that Wi-Fi available. So throughout the airlines, you can touch with your family. And if you travel in the economy also, you can buy that. And uh, they treat you like a chief guest, not guest, actually. They treat all passengers like this. Especially when you go with the Emirates, you try to go by 380 which is a mm-hmm. double story airlines, yeah. uh, which you like really mean uh, ultimate places because your journey starts with that. So this is how I mean, uh, you, you have to put like this itinerary. Mm-hmm. Many things there, uh, you can watch, you can see the cultures, you can see the lakes, Indian foods are widely available in Switzerland. Yeah. There's no need to worry about that. However, if you don't like, you can use uh, local lunches and Sweet. dinners, yep. that's how you can complete your itinerary. So since you are, I would say in a one way, ambassador of Emirates airline also now, yeah. uh, I think so, Emirates should give you a complimentary uh, frequent flyer number uh, also, uh, because you like that airline so yes. much and you keep on traveling on that. Earlier I traveled much, very frequently with the Emirates, uh, but yes, since Corona, travel is less, but yes, traveling now, we going on up, so maybe not today, but future definitely will have the same. <laughs> yeah. I would like to add also, as you rightly mentioned, for the children, uh, the Swiss Minotaur is also there in Lugano, yeah, yeah. which is a very good museum, and they yeah, have yeah. the chocolate factory, which is very near the Zurich part. 
Yeah. Uh, one of the things which I would like to add and I would like to give my experience, which happened at Litlis actually, and it was almost now about a decade back which happened. Uh, we were there, we had gone there for uh, a days with family along with another two families. And uh, we were at Mount Itlis. And my son was making a snowman at the base of Titlis. Oh, great. And the snow was falling from the top. Yeah, I know. And uh, though we had covered up with the clothes, but we had taken Indian style uh, warm clothes and the boats, feeling that they should be enough. No. But yes. You are no, right. actually, uh, see, depend upon when you are traveling. Because if you go to pre winter like October, November, that is a fantastic time to go. You really want to enjoy the cold. Yeah. Then you have to take good amount of clothes, especially in a places called Jermatt and uh, Glacier, as well as Tetanus, as well as Jemfa also. There are four places full of covered the ice. So you need to take the clothes, because probably Indian clothes not working much. Uh, so you have to buy some expensive uh, warmer, so that will help you, and must, uh, most important to cover your head and hat. And then that two things will make you disturb. Uh, mm -hmm. I have seen personally, people travel with me also, they find difficulties too. Because you cannot enjoy if you are not covered of wet. Yeah, I totally agree with you. And my thought process is definitely buy clothes from Europe from the European point of view. Because yeah, they, they, they uh, cover because, it up uh, yeah. their way. Their clothes might be thin, look like, but they be more warmer than the Indian clothes. Yeah. So uh, you need to be take care of them. Yeah. Continuing with my uh, situation, what happened over there. It was tragic situation when we were at Mount Pitless. Uh, as I said, ki, the child was making the snowman outside the uh, train station at the base. I was very happy that he's making something snowman and he's busy. And the chairlift had still half an hour before we could stop, start our journey going up to the top. So after half an hour, we all family along with the other family, we went, we started going on to the top. When we reached the top, we again went on to the ice flyer lift. And when we were coming back, uh, when, when the child came back from the lift, he came inside the warmer area. And in front of my eyes, he collapsed. Luckily, I was there because I had visited uh, Titlis and Switzerland about seven, eight times before. And I had seen the system of how nicely they function. But obviously I was also taken aback for a few seconds. But I immediately picked up my child and I knew where the medical room they have up on the top itself uh, and took him to the medical place. And there we lay him down on the stretcher. Uh, the medical team was equipped. They put up a lot of blankets because the ice maybe would have gone through his feet on top. And that is why I'm correlating the yeah, why yeah. it is important to have clothes, good, proper, clothes. proper clothes along with most important is the shoes and the head. Because oh, exactly. this will all come from there. Come from there, from either the top or from the feet. Uh, they tried their best, but he was still unconscious. It made me more worrisome. But at the same time, what they did was, because they are used to such situations, they immediately called a lift which came in separately only, which was not carrying any passenger. And they did not stop anywhere. It was a kind of a medical emergency kind of a uh, way they were bringing the lift up. We immediately put him onto, the moment it came, we immediately put the child onto the same stretcher and down we went. They had walkie talkies and we had their personnel also along with us. And immediately when we came down in next hardly maybe five to seven minutes, not more than that, the child is still unconscious. My wife is on the top because I had to first take care of the child. I am alone. 
Luckily, the mobiles were still on at that time. They had just come into the market. And down below, I was surprised to see that the ambulance was standing, ready to take the patient. Immediately, they took the patient into the ambulance and drove to the hospital, which is again very nearby, not very far off. They again put up the blankets. Uh, obviously, it was a more warmer place, but he was still unconscious. At that time, I remember only one thing, which we call in India as Dadi Ma Ke Nuske. When I, it just came into my mind. I started rubbing the child's feet. Feet. The moment I started rubbing it, plus along with the medical help was coming in. Within five minutes, he was up, and we started laughing. And I informed my wife and other everybody that everybody is fine. So nothing has to be worried about. They gave us a cup of coffee. Made us stay there for next fifteen twenty minutes to make and sure that nothing is going wrong, and the still he is under medical care. The point why I have made up this this is that when we are traveling, clothes is a very important part, taking care of every situation, and the medical facilities what they have is they really take care so that nobody is inconvenienced. So this is a <coughs> message of. For fellow travelers who are traveling, we all, as tour operators, definitely when there is a group, we try and carry few basics, but the paramedicals and things cannot be carried. So, and yeah, not same, but uh, slightly same experience that we had these trips. Right. Actually, one adult persons, he might got some heart problems because of. Uh, on that day, Tetris was not open actually. Right. It is uh, open uh, only to have some picks. Right. That's all. Okay. But uh, still, there is a minus uh, 13, 14 degree temperatures. Right. So usually people go and they have photographs and come back to the base. Uh, I mean, yeah, in the places where the lobby is there actually. But when I am getting down, we have seen the ambulances there. Some Indian patient get caught out the heart problems, I think. But uh, they covered up very well. Yeah. Nicely in the ambulance only they mix up uh, things. Then yeah. they took to the hospital, hospital. for the, their treatments and all. But uh, definitely you should be take care because cold is actually uh, that places you never know because windy places. Yeah, windy places. When the cold plus windy is, then it's become more difficult to manage. Yeah. If only cold you can manage, but cold plus windy is a difficult to manage. Yeah. So you never know that what time the Pick, the weather can change yeah. and gets down. Yeah. So better to have protections, uh, warmer, hand gloves, must carry, try to have some, you know, caps which cover your, or you can say monkey cap, monkey much cap. better yeah. to do. So you must take care whenever you go to Switzerland, especially in a winter season, even in a summer day also. To be your neighbor knows the main. Yeah, you should uh, always carry the, one, the, one, 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 if the, possible. When the temperature drops down and you get stuck up with that. Yeah, and even at, and if you uh, have forgotten everything, yes. even at the base, they have a shop. Yeah. You can just take it on rent. And uh, yes, you you can rent. You every, can rent it out. Every place is a place near to the ticket counter. Yeah. Uh, you can get some clothes if you don't able to carry it. Yeah. There's jackets also, hand gloves also. Everything is there. Also, everything is there. So if you are unable to carry because of many other reasons, so you can take it from there. Not on the rent, you can buy it also for yeah. future traveling. Yeah. So that's how the things you can travel. Yeah. And that is a good place to go. When you come down, there is an Indian uh, chai wala. Right. You can have chai from there. Okay. That is a good to everybody have singara and all those things you can take. Yeah, and even on the top there, they serve you good they Indian serve you food good, or, uh, or any other food you one want. One thing is definitely there, I can say that uh, I suggest actually, that nobody should take lunch from the travel agents or from the any books because that Indian lunch is not good to so to have lunch there because they don't prepare good, they prepare old foods. It is better to avoid lunch. Mm. You can buy your own, whatever you buy want. Buy your own lunch. That is a good thing rather than because uh, I have seen uh, because when I traveled, 
uh, our lunch also booked but unfortunately the indian restaurant closed on that day right then we get 27 flight tickets mm -hmm. so okay. you get 27 flights you can buy anything there okay or if it is more you can pay from your hostel or if it is in a 27 it's fine so yeah but but still the good part is that they compensate you yeah yeah they compensate you any money which they have taken yeah, yeah. they will honestly give it back to yeah, you yeah yeah that is fair so that's yeah. a very good high level of honesty which yeah, is there. they are maintaining that way because uh, europe is uh, when people are honest there professional there uh, if you have something bookings it will be sure that they try to manage if not they refund everything to you yeah i remember one incident uh, one time when sushir had gone bankrupt and they had filed for bankruptcy flights being the international carrier flights just uh, were not operating and the positive news which came out was people made everybody stay at their homes without charging so that the travelers are not inconvenienced and this is something very good which they did and they made sure in whatever time of one week 10 days or 15 days that everything is normal uh, the country's reputation remains at that level hmm. this is something very good uh, when you buy it, they will give you value for money. Uh, it's not just key. Uh, they are putting something else, the money doesn't, it is not that costly, but they are charging higher amount. So that's very good uh, for that country and even other yeah, European sure, or sure, sure. other countries where they take care of these things. Yeah. Madam, Ma Janni hai. Ma hi bachyo ko sikhati hai. Bachche travel karte hain, seekhte hain. What is your thought process ki your own children, how unho ne progress kiya by traveling way and kya ab unke andar mein ek badlaav dekhte hain ki jo ki traveling se unko den mein mila. Haan, bachche toh obviously seekhte hain, wohat kuch seekhte hain. एक जगह से दूसरे जगह जाना वहाँ के वहाँ के लोगों को देखना वहाँ से बहुत सारी चीज़ें सीखते हैं जो कि उनको फिर वहाँ पे रियलाइज नहीं होता है वो चीज़ें जब आप घर पे आते हैं तो आपको दिखता है वो बच्चों में बदलाव आपको दिख जाएगा yes. तो जैसे कि वहाँ जाने के बाद वहाँ के एटिकेट सीखते हैं फिर वहाँ के लोग खान पान में भी मतलब बदलाव तो आते हैं हाँ डिसिप्लिन है जैसे <coughs> वो एक बहुत बड़ी चीज़ जैसे yes, yes, बच्चों में काफ़ी चीज़ें मिलती है पहले बात तो जब आप कोई आइटनरी शेयर करते हैं उनसे कि वी आर प्लानिंग दिस दे स्टार्ट यू नो रिसर्च ऑन दैट दे विल डू बेटर देन यू एंड बेटर देन एजेंट्स आल्सो दे टेल यू दिस प्लेस मस्ट विजिट उस जगह का हिस्ट्री जोग्राफी yeah. सारे बच्चे मतलब पता, लेते पता कर लेते हैं फिर वहाँ पे जाने के मतलब मतलब इवन पेरेंट्स से ज्यादा बच्चे ही बता देते हैं कौन सा जगह कहाँ जाए मतलब कैसे जाएं तो ये सब चीज बच्चों को मतलब इम्प्रूवमेंट फ्रॉम वे दे नीड टू लाइक इन इंडिया वी डो मिस्टेक्स मेनी मिस्टेक्स एंड बिकॉज ऑफ मेनी अदर थिंग्स बिकॉज नो बडी फॉलो सो वाई शुड आई फॉलो हम बट इन यर ऑफ एन अदर प्लेसेज एवरीबडी फॉलो सो वी हैव टू फॉलो I have seen many Indian cross the road like uh, without seeing the zebra cross also. Yeah. But mandatory to see the zebra cross, wait for your turn to go. Or if you are in a hurry, you can push the buttons. Next light will be yours, and then you can cross the roads. This is how the people learn, and uh, then how to board the trains, how to board the buses, and the many things they learn like they see their environmental factors, food, uh, people how they are living. और ये चीज़ें आगे चल के उनको जैसे मेरी मेरी भी डॉटर है वो अभी पढ़ने बाहर गई है वो वो मतलब बचपन से ही मतलब आउटिंग तो हमारा होते ही रहता है तो देखते देखते चीज़ों को मतलब इतने अच्छे से अडेप्ट कर ली है अभी एक साल भी नहीं हुआ लेकिन वो अपने आप को उस जगह पे Yes. वो उस जगह को समझ ली है उस जगह को और एक्सेप्टेंस बहुत अच्छे से वहाँ तक चीज़ों को एक्सेप्ट कर रहे हैं एक घर में बच्चे रहते हैं तो क्या बच्चे में एकोमोडेशन आ जाते हैं इट क्रिएट ऑफ वेरी फास्ट हाँ कॉन्फिडेंस लेवल इफ दे कीप ट्रैवलिंग बट आफ्टर ऑल ऑफ सडन ट्वेल्व ईयर कुछ दिन पहले किसी ये के किसी एक कॉम्पिटिशन के दौरान उसको इंटर कॉलेज के लिए उसको पौंडीचेरी जाना पड़ा था 
she went by train <laughs> she went to in, uh, class because the uh, college has provided uh, only second the class yeah, second class tickets and she traveled she traveled and she enjoyed a lot uh, with with a lot of group you know. and there uh, whenever she go to uh, hotels where uh, she generally stay with us but um, and she doesn't uh, share the room but that in that hotel that hotel was not uh, quite good enough because it was sponsored by the colleges so uh, it was a competition was there so she was accommodated with them very nicely and she never complained and uh, Pondicherry, when she was talking about the Pondicherry, uh, uh, she explained each and every uh, thing, minute things. A bit of things, uh, yes. Yes, um, uh, very nicely about the sunset, about the sunrise, that we people, maybe I am a mother, I do, don't always feel, I feel the same things, but uh, it, it is also art, uh, finding uh, uh, beautiful things in a uh, traveling uh, uh, this is also art i think mm -hmm. yeah, every yeah. everyone cannot explain properly mm -hmm. but uh, if you, you are a, if he or she may be a traveler then only they can explain the, and uh, how beautifully each and every small things they can uh, see the beautiful things in a small small things yeah one one more thing i think so that the children learn and we also learn Start traveling light. Three pants enough yeah. for a ten day trip. Four shirts enough. Mm. Because when you are traveling to such countries, many of them, if not all, the weather over there, you can wear a t shirt or a t shirt or whatever mm. it is for two days. It doesn't make a difference. Yeah, because there is no pollution. Yeah. So your uh, shoe and your dress will be remain the same, not a smell. Maybe. And now no, the airline has also made it right, uh, That's why the foreigner when come to India, they also get the same kind of dress. Yeah. But they don't understand if the pollution <laughs> level is how much. <laughs> yeah. So you have to wear every time, every hour sexually dress. Yeah. And also one thing oh. is which has also helped is airlines have reduced the baggage which one can carry along. Yeah. But, but the lightweight bad. is by experience that they also Yeah, traveling them. always should be the light. You should carry less amount of clothes. Always carry some foods in your bags because sometimes you may not be able to get. Yeah. yeah. And also they start learning to eat the local food over local there. Local food over there. Not only they stick to your uh, Indian mm. foods because Indian sometimes food. you may not get. Yeah. Or uh, so that you should be hungry. So it is better to adopt the local foods. You get uh, Switzerland in local foods. Basic, non basic, you know, you get everything. Yes, and they are also very and, uh, nice to eat. Actually, yes. once you start eating, then you start enjoying it also. Yeah, yeah, sure. Oh. And uh, I say regarding Switzerland, two or three things very important. This is Switzerland famous because of yes, chakras. Yeah. He's yes. the man who makes Switzerland popular in India. Yeah. Since the Dilwara Dunya Lejaing is started, uh -huh. the people start knowing Switzerland is a heaven on the earth. Right. Uh, the start is a place where yeah. the that station is there. Yes, yeah, start. Where the where the uh, been seen has been taken. Yeah. Or जो काजू को छोड़ता है ना. अच्छा. तो इनमें चला जाता है. Okay. Like घंटी पकड़ के. Yeah. So that is a place actually can go with everywhere. At least you go. The photo लगा हुआ है सारू कान एंड काजू का. Right. And similarly, you go to Jamfra, you find out the photos. Uh -huh. So you go to many places and especially yes, Raj. Favorite place is Interlaken. Right. That is the really best place in the world to stay. Right. So, small place. Yeah. Countryside place. Yeah. And I uh, you know that Interlaken market is a, uh, I think, a highly costly market to buy anything. Yeah. All good brand available there. And then Interlaken place where from where you can manage many places very well. Yeah, because it's, it's Jamfra yeah, is very near there. middle. Tetlis is near. Burn is, burn the capital is, is very near. Is yeah, one uh, hour journey. One hour journey. 50 to one so hour. that is a place you can keep in the itinerary to stay. And then uh, Switzerland cannot complete without train. Yeah. Train is a fantastic. Somewhere you have to mandate it to board a train. Like when you go to Jamfra, mm. after the cable car you have to board a train. Yeah. That is a mandatory for everyone. And uh, Tetlis, well, so every place you can travel. There is no need to hire a taxi in uh, Switzerland. Yeah. Switzerland, you can buy, uh, you know, Euro Pass. Yeah. Euro Pass, uh, in Euro Pass, you can, Euro Rail Pass especially. Yes. You can travel uh, with all uh, economical train journey. 
faster train you may not be able to get because of the Eurorail pass they restricted to only the I mean the, the, the train which have more stop is actually yeah so Eurorail is a very important very thing. important a very economical also. very economical because taxi is a if you pay in a franc then every day you have to pay around 50,000 rupees to the mm -hmm. Yeah, taxis only. Well, and so trains are very neat and clean. Very, very neat, clean. Very neat, clean. And uh, Europe, Europe, entire Europe is well connected with that train. So, and also and the, every uh, second, in, in every hours or every thirty minutes, you get a train for from Interlaken to Bern, Interlaken to Lucen, Interlaken to Engelwald, Interlaken to anywhere. I mean, you can go. Yeah. So. <laughs> Train without train, you cannot make change. You rail, as we are <coughs> discussing, you can travel by the train. Yeah. You can travel by the post bus. It is included into it. Yeah, yeah. If there is no train over yeah, there, yeah. the bus will take Hop, you. Open you bus, you can take. You can take it. Then there is the boats which are there. So yeah. you are very nicely connected. Mm. Uh, few places are there which are not okay. Car free over there. The cars cannot go into the city. Yeah, but train can go to the cities. Yeah, train will go, but uh, beyond that, bus are, so yeah, go, public buses, further. public buses allowed yes. rather than private car not allowed. Yeah, or the electric type of electric, uh, yeah, very, very they will like transport tram, only or tram, uh, uh, baggages, and then you just go walking or even there are places carriages where you can travel. So it's a very nice thing, and again. And if uh, the train says 12.31, it means 12.31, you can... Hmm, punctual. Yeah, they are so punctual. That's a very disciplined city. Everything closed by 5 p.m. Nothing will open. Yeah. Only the food, restaurant will open. That's all. So it's a disciplined city. You will learn discipline there. And uh, you will respect that. Because uh, no one will entertain after 5. Most of the cities. Yes, there are, I um, mean, busy city, there are... You can shop around 8 p.m. But usually, countryside shopping will be closed by 5. So, whenever you want to buy or having shopping plan, you must be on time. Yeah. Uh, time accuracy in entire Europe is important. Even in, everywhere important, but uh, in Europe, yeah, I mean, important. America, if you Singapore, if you Australia. If you the time, you will enjoy most. Yeah. If you're not, then you'll waste something. Even the tourist buses, they are very neat and clean. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Everything. Uh, everything and you have got toilets inside it you don't have to worry yes. about yes the loin monument in Lusan is again a very nice place mm -hmm. to visit over there and also one experience which I had when I went first time to Europe and in Europe my first trip was chosen and I was very fearful how will I reach my hotel mm -hmm. but I wanted to explore and when I landed at the airport, we had these counters who explained us that this is the platform you will pick up your train, go to the main Zurich Bahnhof from the airport, which is hardly five to eight minutes off by train. Mm. And then from there, you are again distributed because that's like our new Delhi railway station yeah. or old Delhi railway station. That you can. It's a very busy railway station. It's a very busy it's a very less uh, uh, stations. But there are ample trains going all the time. I mean, you can make your uh, trip a uh, bit economical. Yeah. Rather than to, or you can make expensive also as much as you want. Oh. There is a no end of that. Right. And also you can travel Europe in an economical way also. Uh, when I have a dream to travel to Switzerland because. Everybody understands Switzerland is heaven on the earth. Yeah. It is. It has maintained that level to attract many people to come. Right. And weather is fantastic. Uh, in India, we talk about the four season actually. In a childhood, I have seen the four seasons like, you know, winter, summer, uh, spring, and then not one. But in today's scenario, uh, I hardly see three seasons in India. One is a summer, winter, and Sometime a spring, mm -hmm. called it. At one hardly a scene. Because in a first season, usually what happens, you know, all the leaves will really fall down and a new leaf will become. But I didn't see in the last 10 years in India, like the place weather has changed. But uh, you go to Switzerland, enjoy that month. You'll find out the new leaves come in the trees. So 
natures are there and how to preserve the nature you will learn. Our Srinagar is definitely like that. But this lack of infrastructures and uh, a lack of, you know, governance also on security threats always being there, that place is not match with that. But uh, yes, uh, I can say Sweden and maintain that labor. And uh, everybody likes to go to Switzerland to see the, how the place is. A curiosity question pushed on me and I'm going to say that you travel up within India, bhi, bahar bhi. So I'm sure souvenirs bhi har jage se le kar aate honge. Yeah, without that your trip will not complete actually. Once you come back you have to have something from there to to have as a remembrance that you had been to travel. Uh, many things there, especially Swiss knife is a very famous, no? Right. Uh, in a whole world. If you go and buy you get multi, you know, was made, multi things there, mm. like nail rings there, then uh, one knife will be there, and there are many varieties available. The Swiss knife. Swiss knife is a uh, one important things to bring. Then uh, uh, Swiss everything is imp- is good, like chocolate. Without that, you cannot complete. Yeah. Bring some chocolate. Children will be there. happy if you yeah. don't buy it. They will tell you only to bring the chocolate from there. Yeah. So you can bring the chocolates. And then uh, you can buy the cuckoo watch. Cuckoo watch is a very famous place there. Um, original cuckoo watch is always there. From there you can buy. We have also bought. Some in India only have one agency in Mumbai. They will help you mm-hmm. if get uh, you know damaged, something like that. And then uh, this is the things you can bring from there. And who can forget the Swiss watches if you have money? Uh, Swiss watches, <laughs> see, Swiss watches uh, that um, that is up to you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> which which range you want to buy? Why? That is up to you. Uh, economical range is T-shirts and then and many other watches, which then uh, Switzerland is specialized in that way. Again, my question. Basically, is, if you look at the industry point of view, the Swiss has majorly of uh, Swiss watches industries, chocolate industries, in dairy products basically, mm-hmm. because uh, fortunately they have a good cause there. And because cows giving a lot of milk and reason that they have plenty of empty field which is flood of grasses and uh, the guy keep churning every day since morning and evening and one souvenir people never forget it's a good for the home also like the uh, guarantee of guy. Yeah, you know, that's you, another thing. Everybody can. Yes, everybody Without can. that you cannot complete the such that. Culturally, what is it that you have derived from there or then aapne apne mentally usko discipline mein imbibe kiya hai ki ye cheez maine wahan se bahut achhi kisi bhi jagah se ho sakti hai wo travel ki seekhta hai insaan aur seekhta hi rahega anything you would like to specify upon see this uh, culturally i mean their discipline is a, is, a, is extremely important to carry it we Indian may not able to cope with that discipline level because of the uh, our nature of uh, I mean uh, job and nature of work and uh, nature of the society is different like in uh, other country the work started from 8 to 4 in India we start 10 that is what the biggest difference that we have and then uh, they are more disciplined in terms of maintaining the time and all. We are not. That is what basically one thing that you should bring it. People <laughs> respect such a great point. Human value is the highest. Human value. Every person. Yeah. Nine to five. You might be a cleaner at a toilet. But uh, but five uh, you are the same as the uh, uh, yes, beer being a child seeing a young teacher. So yeah, this is what you believe it body learning hoti hai. Mat, and, is uh, the traveling karna yeah. and basically you would not find if you talk to local one, you never find they will uh, talk illicit or talk like they are a big rich man so they don't don't talk away. They're very normal people, whether they travel with the Mercedes or the MW, they don't matter. Uh, home and value is the highest level. And also they have maintained their heritage. Mm, yeah, exactly. that is a true. That is a true. That is very important. 
बच्चे क्या देखेंगे yes. अगर हेरिटेज खत्म हो गया तो कुछ दिखाने को है ही नहीं दे प्रिजर्व दे प्रिजर्व द हिस्टोरिकल मोनूमेंट लाइक एनी थिंग्स देर बिल्डिंग मोर देन हंड्रेड टू हंड्रेड को नहीं जा बात है तो वो तो आप कोलकाता में भी बहुत सारे मतलब बिल्डिंग्स आपको वैसे के वैसे ही दिखेंगे मतलब जो जो मतलब वही रेड कलर की जो पुरानी बिल्डिंग चांदी चौक में भी है कुछ भी देखने को इंडिया में तो प्लेटी ऑफ थिंग्स है जो की हर मौसम के लिए यहाँ टूरिस्ट स्पॉट्स है अगर देखा जाए तो कोई जरूरी ही नहीं है कि आप बाहर जाएं। और इंफ्रा वे डेवलपमेंट काफ़ी अच्छा है अभी इंडिया में तो वी वी से बट ये टेट एक्सपोजर यू शुड ट्रेवल द वर्ल्ड नो द पीपल्स हाउ दे लिवस यस मैं आप दोनों की इस बात से टोटली एग्री करता हूँ कि इंडिया में बहुत कुछ है देखने को एंड माई पर्सनल बिलीफ वेर एवर आई गो एंड I'm able to speak, or when I'm addressing the students at different colleges or uh, wherever I get a chance to speak in front of the government or whatever it might be, my firm belief is: even if you are born three times in India, and you only want to travel, still Not India complete. has so much to offer you. Yes. What we complete. able to complete in your three times? Yeah. It is so beautiful. You go to any place, trains, luxury, which are now affordable to Indians at a slightly higher level. Uh, what was only initially Paris on wheels has now there are other trains which are also happening. Palaces are there, weddings are happening. So many. So no doubt, India is also very equally blessed with by the Almighty. That we are able to see so much and give to upcoming generations. Ah, after that, there are many cruises. Where in Banaras? Where? 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 and then you go to few other places the temples are also shown there you land in guwahati and then you ha yeah, india is a fantastic i have travel a good amount in india also tawang to ladakh yeah uh, where ladakh we called it uh, rocky uh, place and uh, tawang is a green place uh, green rocks i tell my friends so hmm. no no you first go ahead and then i'll speak uh, so I've seen, but India has a good thing. But yes, uh, still though we are to Dublin, like in first stages, we are not much higher standard, and especially the safety standard is not that way. When you compare to the Europe, yes, uh, uh, and their safety standard very high rather than there. And I think so. <coughs> they are, they are very justified. That when they put the ticket prices of any entrance or any activity. Oh. that there is an amount which they will charge but that is mandatory actually yeah that should be if you don't charge Char, then how can mm-hmm. you mm-hmm. maintain it maintain yes. that no no that is a necessity to charge because then only you can able to maintain that yeah and like, that actually uh, one then goes and actually enjoys it mm-hmm. the place we are now coming up from the weird things up. because uh, we have also traveled people also travel now they are adopting the things in india like uh, in europe and other places we when you traveled uh, for uh, you know toilet you have to pay you know yeah 0.5 cents or somewhere 1 cent one yeah or there is not is 1 euro one dollar, dollar, one yeah, yeah yeah so just think 1 dollar is around 70 rupees or 80 rupees you are paying for But in India, 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 India they charge ten rupees. Any, any yeah. kind of price. You start shouting on the people oh. that why you are charging yes. <laughs> ten rupees. Yes, I have seen many times. So, uh, but this is coming up. It is not like that. Now we are. The government, the well. government also yeah. has a problem in this situation because see, everybody is not affluent. 
basically problem is not that problem is that the population is all about population that. Is. we are facing the main problem because of uh, we not say that in this front but yes it is because our population upper populated country and uh, less resource so we are fighting it out it is still improving every day and hopefully in some time will come we will be we will be on that way i tell my friends and even corporates with whom i can speak at that level in comfortability uh, and as you rightly mentioned about ladakh uh, by the grace of god i had a chance to take few hollywood actors over there and good corporates and individuals yeah. also so i tell them that uh, when i have to sell something to them as a itinerary that have you ever gone to ladakh or not and if they say no i said when you go up to the heaven the almighty will not open the door for you you will say first go, go back to down again down, and go to go to ladakh let that then come back here then first visit it for one week minimum see the real raw beauty whether you go to kargil site yes kardungla kardungla the roads were not there actually now it is still become much easier now it is good but, but at that time it was real raw way uh no roads at all and you are passing one bus or uh, one uh, car along with the other one and if you see down side you only see deep gorges i remember once i got bit scared and in life anybody can get scared so i was on the front seat the scorpio is actually over there much more good to travel than the other ones so i put on the handle like this so that when i'm i when i start watching this side i don't see the deep gorges because i was scared mentally but that is the real beauty if you have not seen that place then something you have missed out in life this is my personal belief yeah. about ladakh in particular all men there should be uh, t- there should be also a medical film should be there because so i ha- i have heard that one of his uh, friend yeah. i think wo kuch vistas ke baad see wo because of wahan par first day aapko basically sirf late na hai maximum time kyunki wahan air ki kami hai to aap agar first day jab tak used to nahi ho rahe hum human ban ke agar ye sochenge hmm. ki mujhe kuch nahi hua to phir ऑन माइटी बता देगा कि शाम तक क्या हुआ है सो दैट इज एन थिंग एंड देन एनी बडी कैन हैव एनी मेडिकल प्रॉब्लम एट एनी वेयर राइट टोटली एग्री विद यू हमने ग्रुप्स देखे हैं किए हैं चेन्नई से बाइक्स लेकर आते हैं एंड दे गो अप टू फर्स्ट टू मनाली ट्रक्स में भी जाते हैं बाइक्स जाती हैं ड्राइव करके भी जाते हैं और जो मनाली से आगे का रास्ता है वाया सरचू एक्सेट्रा चार पाँच दिन वहाँ लेह में जाते हैं मेरे ख्याल से वो जो थ्रिल पाते हैं इज अनइमेजिनेबल एंड आई हैव सीन ग्रुप्स एंड आई हैव डन ग्रुप्स विच हैव कमिंग फ्रॉम पेरिस ऑस्ट्रेलिया जर्मनी जो कि पूरे दस दस पंद्रह पंद्रह लोग या उससे भी बड़े ग्रुप्स बाइक्स पी एडवेंचर्स नो complete adventure there are interests and there are people jo ki delhi mein sirf yahi bikes kiraye par sirf us area ke liye thi ji ji karol bag ke andar so from here to jo hindustan mein jugadu zarur hai lekin work karta hai aur manali mein bhi usi koti aur sath mein phir unke mechanics bhi sath mein chalte yes yes ki agar kahin kharab ho jaye kuch to mechanics raste mein gaadi theek kar denge aur wo apni mechanic ya to apni gaadi de dega आगे निकल जाएंगे या मनाली से गाड़ी आ जाएगी तो दूसरी बाइक देख के आपको आगे भेज देंगे सो देर इज ए काइंड ऑफ ए कैरवा भी जो चलता है इट्स ए ब्यूटिफुल ट्रिप टू टू आई एम सो फैसिनेटेड बाई लद्दाख आई बीन लकीली ब्लेस्ड बाय दी ऑल माइटी की मैं चार से छः बार ही होकर आ चुका हूँ और आज भी मन करता है दोबारा आ जाए सो दिस इज Ladakh. Yes, Ladakh is good. Uh, thank you, Madam yeah. Sheila, yeah, and Nikhil ji. 
for the nice uh, conversation we had and i thank you from the bottom of my heart uh, and also from our channel venue.events yeah. thank you very much from our side thank you all for giving thank us the opportunity so to say about something travel I'm experience not travel exactly experience. Yeah. i talked about resilient many things we talked actually wish you best of luck thank you Bye. thank you